everyone, welcome back to my channel um, and welcome to a new Chanel video. We're going to talk about Chanel, give you a quick 24C update, um, we'll talk about some prices and then I'll show you some new stuff from YSL and Fendi. I think this will be a short and sweet video. Tell me what you think of this format when it's short and sweet. Tell me if you like it, yes or no, let me know. Let's get started here with the prices for Chanel 24C. Let's start off here with the star bag. <laughs> Um, this star bag comes in a wide range of colors. <laughs> Girl, this is a troll bag. This is a troll piece. Um, this is a big C troll piece, honey. Um, it's, it's with Chanel doing what she does best, um, trolling. Um, it'll be 6,400 um, for the larger one and it will be 5,800 uh, for the smaller one. So $5,800. For the smaller one and the larger one will be six thousand four hundred um again quite pricey but knowing big c's wig it is going to sell this is a troll um piece but you know let big c troll honey let her do it because people will pay so i don't see why not there's a seasonal bag that's coming it'll be six thousand um six hundred us dollars doesn't look like much here so i'm wondering like where they got this idea for the price because it doesn't really look like you know i don't know T to me it doesn't really look like much there's this really really cute maxi um like maxi flap that's coming it'll be eight thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars um i think this is coming in lambskin um love this it's beautiful it's pink it's huge it's vibrant absolutely love it i think it's absolutely gorgeous um there are also these Deauville bags that are coming the smaller one will be seven thousand eight hundred and fifty dollars the larger one will be eight thousand uh, three hundred dollars um the, these prices are quite high i mean these are leather bags um i think that there's a Deauville in this collection that is not leather like it's i don't know what the fabric was um they're quite pricey i think for leather bags but i mean it's chanel being chanel so what else um, do we expect um, to happen? I also wanted to tell you the prices of some of the 22s that are coming. Uh, some of the 22s that are coming, can't speak today. There's this, um, I think this is the mini 22 price. No, this might be the price of something else. Okay, so there, there are three prices here. I'll just tell you the prices. There's one size that's $6,150. There's another size that's $6,250, okay? And then there's another one that's going to be $6,850. Um, uh, so it's coming in a wide range of pricing and I'd love to know what are your thoughts on the pricing? Um, so those are just some of the prices that I know. I don't have the prices for everything, but those are some of the prices that I got um, for some of the things that are coming um, from the collection. Um, the prices, yeah, for the uh, for the 22, I don't know, they're quite high, but I mean the 22 prices are high. Um, in general so like i said there's one that's 6150 and there's another that's 6250 um and there's another one that's 6850 i only know us dollar prices for now i don't know euros or pounds or any other currency and once i do um i'm sure i'll post it on my social media so go follow me on instagram um go follow my tiktok go sign up for the newsletters link below and of course go join the facebook group i'd love to see more chanel people in the Facebook group. If you love Chanel, go join the group, it's linked below and go show us your like Chanel collection or tell us what you're getting from the brand or if you're gonna pick anything up um, from this um, collection. So that was just a quick Chanel 24C update that I wanted to give you. There are a lot of new um, pictures as well. I think by now I would have inserted pictures um, of the things that are coming. You know I don't really like blue, but I wanted to show you this Tiffany blue um, Chanel 22 that's coming. I think many of you will like this. I love that they went for gold hardware for this one. Um, I love that they went for gold hardware um, for this one. I think it's a really beautiful um, color um, for this. And again, even though I don't like blue, I can appreciate beautiful blues and there's nothing more beautiful than like a Tiffany blue. It's just such an iconic shade of the color. Um, and there's also this 22, this really beautiful like oil slick hardware really really beautiful love the hardware of this beauty i'm sure that this will sell and do very well this is really really nice um, as well okay now i wanted to tell you guys about some things which i saw on the ysl website 
I posted these on my Facebook. I posted these on my Facebook page. I cannot speak today. I posted these on my Facebook page yesterday. My Facebook page is public, so you can just go on my page. It's linked below, um, and see um, the pictures. I posted a bunch of these new YSL um, boots um, for autumn winter. They're, some of them might not be new, new, but um, these are like new, uh, like to, definitely new to me um and they have like put them on the website and obviously because it's autumn winter now in the western world i'm sure that these will be very popular i wanted to show you two of my favorite ones like i said i put all of them the ones that i liked i put them on my um facebook page links below you can go look at the album but um i really love um this one right here the name of this boot is called otoi this is absolutely stunning it comes in two options there's one that's just a classic um, like a classic knee length just just below the knee length boot and then there's another one that is over the knee the one that's just below the knee is made of leather um, the one that's over the knee I think it's like a stretch vinyl absolutely gorgeous beautiful love these again I put the prices on my Facebook page which is public you can just go and look at it love 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 these I think these are so like fashion forward I think they're so stylish I love that beautiful gold heel on the um, uh, under the knee one I think that's just so stylish it's so chic imagine like walking up and down the streets you know of London of Paris of New York of Milan Rome you know Shanghai Sydney Singapore walking down the streets and you are strutting in these bad girls right here love these I thought they're so gorgeous so beautiful just had to let you know about them I'll link them below as well on YSL's website so you can go look at them um, in more detail I think they are show-stopping fashion forward statement pieces so I just had to show you them so tell me what you think about these because I love them I think they're so gorgeous so beautiful Fendi have a new um, capsule collection um, this collection has been curated by Stefano Pilati, an Italian fashion designer. Wide range of options, as I said, from this Fendi Winter 2023 capsule um, curated by Stefano Pilati. Um, there's so much, but I just wanted to quickly show you um, some of the pieces that I really liked. Um, there's this really beautiful peekaboo I See You. It's in this burgundy braided leather. It's going to be 4,800 euros. This is really beautiful. There's something very comforting about this. I don't know what it is, but it makes me think like of being at home, like with a bowl of soup on a cold day in a jumper being curled up on the sofa. I think it's the colors, like it feels so comforting and nourishing and warm for autumn winter. Absolutely love this. I think it's really, really cool. I also wanted to show you this really beautiful dress. It is a burgundy um, dress. It's going to be 3,000 euros. I thought this was so beautiful, so stunning, so autumnal. I think when people think of autumn, they think of colors like this with um, clothing. And I think that, yeah, this is just really beautiful, really luxurious. This um, capsule will be for men and women. So there's also a, there are also men's new arrivals, men's new arrivals for this collection. Um, alongside women's there is so much to choose from so like I said I'll just be putting up pictures on the screen of things that you can go and pick up and you'll let me know um, what you think there is so much they have some really cute like fur accents um, products as well there's like this like there's like a mink fur bag handle or something as well for the for the peekaboos it's so 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 cute they also have watches they have um, braided leather baguettes they have so much in this capsule let me know what you think about this capsule i'd love to know your thoughts on this one um and what do you guys think in general and generally speaking i'm a versace girl first and a moschino girl first um but i do like fendi uh, i like their fur products i like the clothing um, i like a lot of the things that they do they also make exotics i love that they have some really beautiful um exotics as well i might actually do a, a video um, of Fendi's exotics because I think that they require their own video. I have an exotics video I'm working on where I show you exotics that are not Big H, it's not Louis Vuitton, it's not Dior. There are a lot of other really, no, well, no, I, Dior wanted to include them. Uh, there's a video I'm working on, but it's going to take some time because I want to film it when I go to Europe so I can show you like a wide range of exotics. But um, um, yeah, I really like Fendi. I think that they're very nice. Um, I think it's a brand that I am seeing things that I like. Um, like I said, I'm a Versace Moschino girl, but 
I think I like Fendi and I think I am enjoying a lot of the things that I see from them. They have really nice boots as well. I wanted to show you this really cute set. I think this is my favorite um, ready to wear piece from this collection. Um, well, it's not a set. It's like it's like a like a cohort. There's a jumper. It's a cashmere jumper. It's one thousand eight hundred. It's a little bit of a turtleneck. I don't really like those, but I think this one is not too much. And um, there's this skirt, which is nine hundred eighty euros. Great price. It's also cashmere. Very very cute. Loving what I'm seeing from them. I'll definitely pass by the store when I go traveling. What did you guys think of the Chanel 24C price um, list and price updates for certain items? And what are your thoughts on the YSL Auto boots? And of course, what do you guys think about the Fendi Winter 2023 collection curated by Stefano Pilati? What are your thoughts? Let me know. Um, if you like these videos where we talk about maybe one of the, one of the like more popular brands, but then we mention other Maisons, let me know. I have a wide range of interests, guys. I like many things. Um, I just want to post the videos that you guys will watch and enjoy. So let me know. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, drop comments below and tell me what you think about everything. Go find me on social media. I'm everywhere you are. Um, I was telling Edwin, I was like, I need to get more serious about TikTok. And he's like, you need to get serious. I feel like I've just... Like, I, I, I get serious, I'm like, I'm posting, I'm posting, I'm posting! And then I stop posting and I'm like, okay, I'm done. <laughs> you know? Go follow me on TikTok. Inspire me, go follow me on TikTok, and just be like, hello, post something. <laughs> because then I'll post it. So I'm also on Instagram as well. Um, so yeah, find me everywhere you are. I am there. I cannot wait to hear what you guys think about Chanel 24C, um, the YSL boots and the Fendi Winter 2023 collection. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the weekend in my next video.